Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to Open More Toys. Today on Open More Toys, we have an Adventure Time episode. So we're going to open up two Adventure Time blind boxes. That's these tins here of Jake and Finn. And then we have an Adventure Time toy. This is awesome, awesome toy. This is Finn in a Jake suit. And then we have this awesome giant Play-Doh surprise egg. So which toys are we going to open up first? I think we should open up these blind boxes first. So we got the Finn and Jake collector's tins, or I should say the blind box tins. And each one has a figure inside, and it's a mystery of which one's inside, and there's 12 figures inside. So let's go ahead and open up this one first. So after getting off the wrapper, you can see that this Jake tin is awesome. It opens it up the head there, and then there's a mystery toy inside. And then the side, you can see the tail, his arm, so it's pretty well like detail for a tin. It's kind of a toy in and of itself. And inside our bag, who's our first character that we're going to get today? Oh, awesome. So we got a Jake toy right inside our Jake blind box today. That doesn't always happen, but we got pretty lucky there. Pretty cool toy there. And they're from Funko Pop, so or I should say Funko, and so they have their own unique style to them. That's why they're like boxy like that, so pretty neat. So next we're going to open up this Finn blind box. Pretty cool. On the back you can see the artwork of his backpack and his sword right there. His arms are on the side. Let's go ahead and open him up and see what figure we get inside him today. Oh man, it looks like we got Zombie Finn. Scary. Look at Zombie Finn. I think he wants to take a bite out of the Play-Doh Finn there. Nom, 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 nom. So now let's go ahead and open up our Adventure Time toy here. Pretty awesome. This is Finn in a Jake suit. So Finn is completely wearing Jake. And on the back you can see that there's a, a bunch of other toys and none of them I could find. Hopefully I can find them soon and maybe I can put them in another episode. But I was able to find this one at a local Toys R Us that I went to. And uh, let's go ahead and take a closer look at them. This is a pretty cool action figure. You know, he's all muscular and buff like he's a total superhero. And uh, Finn, you know, obviously he can't get hurt because Jake is completely surrounding him. It's pretty neat and it's really poseable. Like everything moves. He's got, he's very detailed, very highly, you know, his, his arms rotate, his, from his elbows, his shoulders, pretty much everything, even his waist. So pretty cool toy. All right, it's time to open up our giant Play-Doh surprise egg, our Adventure Time Finn surprise egg. So I'm sorry about this, Finn, but I'm going to have to peel back your face there so we can get to the surprises. And let's see who's inside or what toys are inside. So right there, we can see some cool kid robot toys some Tokidoki stuff. And what else? We're going to have to remove the rest of the Play-Doh and open it up to get to it. And while we're opening up this egg here, I want to remind you all, check out my other videos on my channel. I have so many other giant surprise eggs. And let me know in the comments down below what other surprise toys that you want me to open up. Alright, it looks like we have some Minecraft stuff, some is that an Angry Bird blind box, and another Adventure Time item there. So a bunch of cool toys in there. Since this is an Adventure Time episode, let's go ahead and open up that Adventure Time item that we saw there. This is an Adventure Time dog tag. There's 20 to collect. This is a Series 1 bag here, so let's open it up. It's not like the other blind bags where they are the dog tag bag where they come with stickers and everything. This just comes with a checklist. And it looks like just a dog tag. So let's see who we have. Alright, it says number 5 Marceline the Vampire Queen. So there she is, that's Marceline the Vampire Queen playing her axe guitar. Alright, up next we're going to go ahead and open up this Minecraft minifigure blind box. So this is a Grass Series 1, so if it's a Series 1, hopefully soon they're going to make a Series 2. So we have opened up a few of these before, got some really cool figures, let's see who we have today. 
And it looks like we have a snow golem from Minecraft. Pretty cool. Kind of reminds me of like Olaf wearing a pumpkin head. <laughs> Next, we have a kid robot blind box. This is an Art of War Dunny. So, they're supposed to look like Bunny Rabbit slash Masters Arts of War characters. So, we opened up one before. We got like Nerd with a Jedi lightsaber. So, that was pretty cool. And I wonder who we're going to have today. a little card inside and this is the character that we have so can't tell who that is let's take a closer look at the toy now it comes with a sword and it comes with this skull mask so that's neat all right and on the bottom it says we have Huck G so it looks like a, like a ninja samurai type character pretty awesome and he has a really cool mask looks pretty scary with that mask but there he is. He's a 1 out of 20 character, so not too common, not too rare. Pretty awesome. I think this is the one character I really wanted to have, because I really like that mask. Kind of reminds me of something from like Call of Duty or something. On the back of his ears it says, Game Over. So I think this is supposed to be sort of like a Call of Duty type character. So there he is with his mask on. And, uh, takes a little positioning to get that on there right, but we'll do that later. Now what's different about this guy's body compared to the one on the box is completely different. So did I, I don't know if I got some sort of unique character or something like that, or they just made a mistake on the box artwork. Next we have this Angry Birds uh, blind box toy, it's not really a box, because the case itself looks like a toy. And inside we have the checklist of the all the keychain toys that we can get in here, our bag of candy. And then we get a sticker of the character of the toy that we have inside. So, awesome. It looks like we got the little blue birds from Angry Birds. And here he is. Let's get him out of his wrapper. Now, in the game, I really like this bird because, you know, when you push him, his normal ability is like he splits into three and he's really good at breaking ice and stuff. So he's really neat and useful. All right, our next toy is a Tokidoki toy. This is the Royal Pride Tokidoki. And the box looks like a little subway car. Opened up a few of these. We got that character there, and we got that character there. Let's see who we have today. And the theme with these toys are like everybody's like a cat person or like a lion or something similar to that. Looks like we got a black female cat there, and she is totally blinged out. She's got the earring, she's got a awesome handbag there, some jewelry, cheetah print shirt, and a big diamond ring. So that's a really cool, neat cat toy there. And this is something new I saw in the stores. It's a My Little Pony a Squishy Pops. Be the first one I, I open up with these. I only saw the I saw these at Toys R Us. Picked up a few of them and wondering what they are. I kind of see through the bag. It looks like we have some pink and yellow. So I think we have. Yep, it's Fluttershy. And for a very small toy, these things are highly detailed. They look pretty good for such a small toy. The hair is pretty good. And it has a little suction cup on the bottom and a little plastic ring. And I think what you do is push the suction cup on something like, like a table or glass on a flat surface. And then it will eventually like clip and pop. But I'm not exactly sure. But it's a cool little toy that, by itself. Next we have this Flappy Birds mash -um. And when this game came out... I was addicted to it on my iPad. I just kept on playing it and playing it, trying to beat all my friends. It's so addicting. And then I found out one day they took it off the store. The creator took it off and everybody couldn't get it anymore. And so they made a bunch of like similar games. So we got a little blue flappy bird here and that's what it does in the game. It goes up and down, up and down, trying to make it to the pipes. And usually you lose eventually. <laughs> but this is a mashup so it's really, really squishy. Pretty cool.
few of you have asked me to do some more Doctor Who stuff, saying that you love Doctor Who, so I'm going to open up another Doctor Who blind bag. Haven't done one of these in a while, so let's see who we get. And then, you big Doctor Who fan, write in the comment the name of the character inside, okay? Alright, it seems like our uh, Doctor Who character today is in a bunch of pieces, so let me go ahead and put them together. And here we are. Pretty cool toy, reminds me of Legos, and you know, you just build them and put all his pieces in. So if you know the name of this Doctor Who figure here, go ahead and write it in the comments. Then we have this Legend of Zelda mascot Danglers. The reason we're opening up the Zelda stuff is one, I like Zelda, I like the video games, I used to play them all the time, but somebody in the comments wants to see more Zelda stuff. So here we are. This is to my fans that want the Zelda toy. Here we have a little Link figure. Awesome, and Link's holding a jar. I'm sure this is some sort of weapon in one of the video games. Uh, which video game? I'm not sure, but gotta be one of the ones from the the newer ones that has a little plant hat on and everything like that. So if you know which game this character of Link comes from, write it in the comments. Here we go as a first time blind box. This is a Vinylmation Mickey's Christmas Carol. So it's supposed to be like the movie, the Christmas Carol Disney movie. And you get all the characters. There's 12 here with one mystery character too. So let's go ahead and open up the Vinylmation blind box. And it looks like we got a little uh, Donald Duck character. Awesome. And he comes with an accessory here too. And it looks like, oh yeah, it's his hat. That's cool. And it has little notches there so it can fit through his ears. So let's go ahead and push that on there. And we have Donald Duck from Christmas Carol movie. Here we have another Toki Doki toy. This is a Punk Star Frenzies little keychain accessory toy here. Oh, this is neat. So another little cat, but it's an actual cat. And it's got a little pink hairdo and a bunch of little accessories too. Pretty cool. I'm gonna go ahead and I know a friend who would love this, but they love cats. And our very last prize toy today is going to be this Skylanders Giant Blind Bag Jumbo Puzzle Eraser. So I shouldn't actually say it's a blind bag because the name of the character is right on the front. And his name is Swarm and he comes in a bunch of different pieces. I mean, yeah, he's completely made out of erasers. So let me put them together and here's our finished Swarm. Looks pretty cool. He's not as giant as the other blind bag one or the other Jumbo Erasers. Whoops, his little thing fell off there. Put that back in. But yeah, he's really cool looking still, even though he's not as big as the other ones. Alright, that's all the time we have today on this episode of OMT, the Adventure Time Giant Surprise Egg episode. And if you like this Jake and Finn Adventure Time episode, go ahead and click the big thumbs up button down below. Let me know that you like it and uh, I'll continue to make more videos like this. And don't forget, if you haven't already, click right here on the screen to go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Alright, thanks for watching this episode of Open More Toys. See you next time.